What is up UFC card fiends? As you can see, got a new setup. I was tired of standing up over there in my old setup. I feel like the depth was cool, but now I get to be comfortable. I get to, you know, put up these little setups on my wall. Stay tuned for what's gonna go on this. A little niner right here. I got a little trio right there that I'm gonna fill out as well. I still need to fill out some stuff, you know, like a few things, but guys, I am excited for UFC 300. I've had quite a bit of work, so I haven't posted much, but you better believe I've been consuming some UFC 300 content. Embedded has been sick. The press conference was awesome. The weigh-ins, everybody looks good. I don't believe anybody missed weight. I may be wrong, but I cannot wait, guys. I'm going to sleep super late, but I wake up just in time for Garbrandt versus Figueredo. Which, by the way, let me know who you got on that fight. I feel like, ah, uh, I was leaning Figgy for a while, but I don't know, guys. I don't know. Cody may surprise. Cody may surprise. But, guys, why did you click on this video? I got some awesome Charles Oliveira mail day. It's going to be his day tomorrow, guys. Saturday, UFC 300. Charles Dubronx Oliveira getting that dub. Jem, I'm sorry, my brother, but, you know, Armin is still young. He has a bright future in this lightweight division, but Charles, I believe, is at his prime. But, guys, enough of that. Let's get into the Charles Oliveira mail day. I got some heat, guys, plus my very first glove that I will put somewhere here. Let's get it. Subscribe. Guys, I have had this beautiful glove signed by Charles Dubronx Oliveira. Just Chilling back here for a minute. I had been meaning to do this video earlier, but it is what it is, guys. We get it when we get it. Let's check this out. All right. Let's see what we got here, guys. UFC. What do you guys think of the new gloves that they just released? Huh? Are they going to use them in 300? I don't think so, right? Uh, all right, guys. There's only one thing left to do. And that is to try it on. All right. One signed glove to rule them all, guys. This is sick. <laughs> Jeez. Am I going to open with this, guys? Am I going to be the first guy to show you some mail day with the signed Charles Dubronx Oliveira UFC glove? Man, these don't feel comfy at all. I can see where the fighters are training. <laughs> It seems like that wrist uh, thing that they incorporated on the new gloves might be a heck of a lot better. Uh, this is very, very cool, guys. Anyway, this is probably gonna not work out, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna take this off and we're gonna chill it right here and just display it, you know. But let's get going, guys. We are going to actually cover this with this. This is going to be special. We're going to save it for last. What do we have here? 
There we go. Oh, that's nice. Look at this, guys. Speckle out of 299. That is number 204. Oh, these are lovely. I still can't believe these are out of 299. These should have been out of like 99 or uh, out of 75, I think. Beautiful card. We are going to put you right here. And what do we have next, guys? This insert is just phenomenal, I think. You know, in my humble opinion, this insert is just so cool. That is, you know, classic Charles. He looked awesome at the weigh-ins. No sunglasses, but same pose. Look at this beautiful card, man. Love it. I pulled the Shavkat. I wasn't, you know, too sad about that. But I had to get me a Charles. All right, let's keep the train going, guys. I don't want to keep y'all too long. I want to post this Saturday morning if I can. Sheesh. This was the first card that I purchased <laughs> on maybe like, I don't know, a day or two or three after after tops drop, maybe on the 21st. I don't know. But this was the first card that I purchased. I sent an offer for like eight bucks, I think, and got accepted. So happy for me, guys. This is a great, beautiful insert, man. The 101 vinyls of this, gee, just phenomenal. I don't know if Charles's has been pulled, but if it has, let me know, let me know, guys. And what do we have here? Guys, so sometimes when you're on eBay, you forget that you bid on one. <laughs> you forget that you had already bid on one. And so we got two. This will be included in a giveaway at some point, sometime soon. Maybe it'll be an Instagram giveaway. If you're not following me there, follow me. If you don't know, I got a YouTube giveaway going on. As soon as we hit 250 subscribers, I will be giving away these cards. All right, guys, back to Charles Dubronx. Looks like they're both pretty well centered. Um, can't complain. I may just keep both of them. Who knows, guys? I'm crazy like that. Don't mess with me. Now for the awesome card. I think it's this. It should be. If I remember correctly, guys, if you don't know, I don't really spend much on cards. At, on one card, I should say. <laughs> because when all of them together comes out to a bit. But, hey, I'm not here crying, guys. Let's see for the reveal. Here we go, guys. I am... So excited to add this to the collection. <sighs> Charles Dubronx Oliveira. This is National Treasures from my favorite year, 2022 Chronicles. Slightly thick boy right there. Love that it was sh shipped well in the top loader sometimes you know i don't really recommend shipping in top loaders but this was very well packaged it was just one in there in between cardboard and then the package was also padded it was just well packaged thank you whoever shipped me this 
Well, I'm going to enjoy this for a second. This is 17 out of 99. We got us part of the mat there. The enclosed fighter worn. The enclosed fighter worn used material and autograph are guaranteed by Panini America. Does anybody miss Panini? I kind of miss Panini. Beautiful, beautiful edition. No squiggle. Squiggle. No squiggle. Gotta love it. I love me some squiggle for sure. But I just had to. I know it's just a sticker as well. This is actually on glove. Charles touched this. I put it in my hand. So now I got the power. Charles DuBronx. Oliveira. What are you going to do? And that's it, guys. I couldn't be more excited for UFC 300. Drop a like if you're excited to. Drop a comment. Let me know what was your favorite part of this Charles DuBronx mail day. Let me know who you got. Charles or Armin. I think it's going to be a great fight. I think it's going to be... Oh, it's going to be fantastic, guys. Okay? Stay tuned for how I continue to fill out the new space here. Let me know what you think of it. Let me know if the other one was better. If it was, I'm screwed because I'm not going back. I already bought the L-shaped desk, which I am loving. I got everything set up here now. Don't got to move. I just got to do this. And with that, guys, peace.